Welcome to this Stiegel video about how you can add your Google Calendar Outlook using its private URL. It takes four very easy steps to do this. You get your Google Calendar's private URL. In Outlook, you use the file menu and go into account settings, then internet calendars and choose to add a new internet calendar. You paste the URL for your private uh, Google Calendar and then you can view the calendar in Outlook. Let's see this in action. Here's my Google Calendar with some sample events on. I hover over my mouse over the calendar on the left and I choose the little drop down menu and in there I go into calendar settings. Once into calendar settings I scroll down to the private address section and we can copy the link address of the iCal private URL. Once we have that copied, we can switch over to Outlook. This is Outlook 2016 using an Office 365 account. We use the file menu. Then we go to account settings. Once account settings pops up, we can go to internet calendars. There we can use the new button. We can paste in the URL of the calendar and note you don't need to change the HTTPS you want to keep that on as is and use the add button that will ask you to name your Google Calendar so I'll just give it a sample title Google Calendar use your OK button and that's immediately added to Outlook so you can close your account settings box you find you now have the Google Calendar as an option under other calendars. And you can see this matches my Google Calendar. There are some limitations with this approach. This only displays your Google Calendar. You cannot edit this calendar or sync it in Outlook. If you wish to do this, you need to use Google Apps Sync in coordination with the Google Apps for Work account. And the private URL shows everything. If you give somebody else this private URL, every single event you add to your calendar will be visible to them. Thanks for watching. We hope this has been useful. And you can find more Google Calendar videos at Stiegel.com.